hey everybody and welcome back to my kitchen you guys this is the first video at least the first kitchen video that I've done or that I am doing since we took our dude number two to college y'all I miss him so much this is just it's definitely gonna take some getting used to but my birthday was on October the 1st when we moved him in so my children celebrated my birthday the day before and this is one of my birthday gifts my pretty new apron with all of the beautiful butterflies so, so let's get started today we will be making some rotisserie chicken salad sandwiches and these are the ingredients that we're going to need to make this very simple recipe. You guys, it's very easy. It's a very quick, simple recipe. Anything that I share with you, feel free to add more, add less. Don't add it all. Whatever tickles your fancy. So first, we're going to start off with a beautiful store-bought seasoned rotisserie chicken. And we're going to end up pulling all of this chicken off of this bone. I have some beautiful butter croissants that we're going to use for our bread with our rotisserie chicken salad sandwiches. Then we will be using mayonnaise. I'm using some light mayonnaise. You can use the regular mayonnaise. You guys, I'm trying to eat a little better most of the time. Sometime. Then we will need a little bit of sweet salad cubes. I have some salt pepper, a little dash of sugar from my mama's mom and daddy's sugar bowl that I grew up with. And instead of me using celery, I'm going to use celery seed. You, by all means, you can use the real fresh celery, but I'm not using that today. I have two eggs that I've already boiled. And I have about a cup of grapes. My husband loves grapes in his chicken salad. Okay? So we're going to start by getting this chicken deboned. And you guys, this is probably what's going to take the longest as it pertains to doing this recipe. Of course, I've already washed my hands. My hands have been thoroughly washed. Y'all don't be in the kitchen with nasty hands. Y'all already know that's just nasty. I think I forgot to mention too, I have a little bit of red uh, onion cut up here. Very, just a little bit. Maybe about a tablespoon and a half. So now I'm just going to uh, get this chicken, all, all of this chicken off of here. I'm not going to be nice about it at all. You're just going to snatch it off. And as I'm pulling it, I'm just going to get it all in this little, I wanted to use this pepper chef, Pampered Chef uh, mixing bowl because it has this lid on it that's a, that will seal it really tight. So that's what I wanted to store my chicken in. So that's why I'm using this particular mixing bowl. These rotisserie chickens are so good. And after I get most of it in here, then I'll go back and, you know, try to kind of cut it up a little bit. I won't. Y'all already know I'm going to eat some along the way. getting a little bit of this the skin in there too because that skin is delicious and it has so much flavor and I 
probably don't need to make all of this because since it's just me and my dude number one not that dude number two ate chicken salad anyway he didn't eat it anyway but we can also use you know just make some plain um, chicken sandwiches too just, just get it off here y'all don't be gentle at all Cut it up to you to your liking. If you like larger pieces of chicken, then by all means, you don't have to cut it up too small. So now we're going to start with, with our mayonnaise and you guys we're just going to dump everything in here. I'm going to start with maybe about a cup of mayonnaise. You can always add more but you guys you can't take it out once you get it in there. So just add the mayonnaise gradually okay. I'm going to also, I want some of the juice as well, okay? So I'm going to start with two tablespoons. You can 
cut them as large or as small as you like. And the fact, since I'm just making this for us, for me and my dude number one, I don't necessarily try to get the egg too, too small. Because again, we really like eggs. But when I'm fixing like potato salad and I know that other people will be eating the potato salad, I try to get the eggs cut up kind of small. Just a little bit of salt, just a little bit. And do the cracked pepper. And then just a little bit of sugar. Mix this up just a little bit before I add in my grapes. Okay, now that I have it all mixed up, I'm going to taste it first before I add in my grapes. Just a little bit more sweet cubes. So let's say three tablespoons. And with these ingredients, like I said, if you don't like sweet cubes, don't add them. Some people don't prefer to have sugar, but we like our. Um, rotisserie chicken salad with a little sweetness so that's why I add the sugar okay, I'm going to use this to kind of clean up the side of my bowl a little bit Ooh, I just hate it miss it looking container with food in it. Okay, now I'm going to add in my grapes. He got stuck in there, so I just decided to eat him. If you don't like grapes, don't add them, but then do. If you like them, add these and then some. Some people also like to put pecans in their rotisserie chicken salad. My husband has never tried that, so he said if I wanted to, I can sit some aside, so um, he can just try that and see if he likes it. And y'all, that's it. It is just that simple. Good. And it's going to be on that buttery croissant. Yes. And 
this is all I do to clean up my container. And then where you can see around the edge where I wiped, you know, I just kind of kind of spread it out a little bit. Kind of cover that up so it won't be so obvious that I wiped around the edge of the container. Y'all, that's pretty. It's going to be so good. Okay. So we like our um, chicken salad cold. Mm. Let me garnish it just a little bit on the top with some more pepper. So I'm going to let this chill for probably about an hour. And then I will come back when I, when I put our sandwiches together. Okay? You guys, look at these beautiful rotisserie chicken sandwiches. Mm. Y'all want some? Y'all want a bite? Y'all want a bite? Open your mouth. You gotta open your mouth wide because it's a whole lot of chicken salad on there. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yummy. Look, they go him. Hey, everybody. <laughs> I got a cheese doodle to go with mine. Just one cheese doodle? Yeah, that's going to be it. Well, you guys, we're going to eat some chicken salad. Wow. You going to take a bite? Yes. And don't slob on the plate. Make sure you get it. Okay. Oh, I was, was going to hold it for him while he beat it. You and your grapes. Mm. Mm. And y'all, he toasted these croissants. You could just smell the butter when they were um, toasted. Mm. Can I have a bite of yours? Mm. I mean, you really have one. I got to hold them too late. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm. Listen, guys, as I always say to you guys. That's good. Yeah. I have so much to eat. Bread. Bread makes the sandwich. Mm -hmm. If you fudge on the bread, you're gonna have, not have a great sandwich, guys. Get the bread. So we have the the butter, um, butter Maybe. croissant. Make sure that's all good. butter croissants. That's what they call it. All butter croissants. All butter croissants. Yeah. And I got these from the Walmart Deli. They were on clearance too. We saved 99 cents. So, the all butter croissants. Bread, guys, is everything. It does. It makes a Bread is everything. Sandwich. So, with that said, get yourselves on a, um, get yourself a nice, um, nice, I don't know if you want a biscuit or a bun or. The British buns would be good too. Yeah, the British buns would be good. Yeah, so, you know, get yourself some nice bread and that will be chicken salad sandwich and go with it, guys. Go with it. And so, with that said, I just want to say thank you guys for taking time being here with us. I told him this was our first video since dude number two. Yeah. So he's getting ready to FaceTime us in a few minutes. He just finished the workout. He's ready to take a shower and FaceTime us. So we got to go. Got to go. See you later. Bye. Push the nosy. Push the nosy. Shake something. Bye, you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. We already look forward to you joining us up. Yeah, next time. Yeah. Bye.